Cave Johnson. I own the place. That eager voice you heard is the lovely Carolyn, my assistant. Rest assured, she has transferred your honorarium to the charitable organization of your choice. Isn't that right, Carolyn? Yes, sir, Mr. Johnson. She's the backbone of this facility. Free as a postcard, too. Sorry, fellas. She's married. To science. I don't think you're supposed to be able to do that, actually. I think you can do something like this. I don't remember the last time I tried this, I... Oh, okay. I kind of like tried flying there and trying to reason it, reaching it. <laughs> I kind of fucked this shit real hard, that's for sure. So, um... Yeah. Actually, I actually still don't know what the fuck I'm even doing anymore. What am I doing here? I'm confused. I are confused. Am I still supposed to jump down from here, maybe? I don't know, why the fuck would I do that? I think. Uh, you know what? Forget. You on the move! That actually worked! Somehow! There's a thousand tests performed every day here in our enrichment spheres. I can't personally oversee every one of them, so these pre-recorded messages will cover any questions you might have and respond to any incidents that may occur in the course of your science adventure. Your test assignment will vary depending on the manner in which you have bent the world to your will. Those of you helping us test the repulsion gel today, just follow the blue line on the floor. Those of you who volunteered to be injected with praying mantis DNA, I've got some good news and some bad news. Bad news is we're postponing those tests indefinitely. Good news is we've got a much better test for you. Fighting an army of mantis men. Pick up a rifle and follow the yellow line. You'll know when the test starts. <laughs> well, I'm fucking glad I'm not in that time period. Cave Johnson, Mr. Wank pile of shit. Something stupid, I'm not fucking sure. Oh, and I'm a fucking idiot. That guy got to be person of this place. I don't fucking know. Those are my best traits. Hmm. Did I mention it's cold? It's cold. Kinda freezing. I kinda just wanna snuggle down in bed. I just. Post myself up, but that would be nice. Caution to not fall down the, the elevator shaft. Yeah, brilliant. Uh, oh, stay there, so we there. And loud noises. Also nice. No. Okay, hey, you there. Um, no. Oh, there I think. And I'm supposed to jump down from here. And down I go. Wee and don't die, please. Holy shit. I do not receive any training in this kind of flying shit. I don't know. Stuff. Mm. I'm pretty sure that's supposed to be algae for just about fucking everyone. Perfect. 
They say great science is built on the shoulders of giants. Not here. At Aperture, we do all our science from scratch. No hand-holding. Uh, can I? Can I explain why you shit the hell? Well, to shit. I guess. I don't know. All right, right, let's get started. This first test involves something the lab boys call repulsion gel. You're not part of the control group, by the way. You get the gel. Last poor son of a gun got blue paint. <laughs> All joking aside, that did happen. Broke every bone in his legs. Tragic, but informative. Or so I'm told. That's. Yeah. Um. <laughs> Looks different. Much different, actually. Repulsion yell was Aperture's first attempt to create the dialic pudding substitutes. It's true, the yellow is really slightly less non toxic form, fiber less insulation than its cause of some yellow synchronous ingestion of food items to balance off the lining of diarist to the stomach and artist on her mouth. For various reasons this product was pulled from shelves. Well gee, I do wonder fucking why. Why? Um All right, now I obviously get need to get up here. And over there. So. Oh. When do just informed me that I should not have mentioned the control group. They're telling me I ought to stop making these pre-recorded messages. That gave me an idea. Make more pre-recorded <laughs> messages. I pay the bills here, I can talk about the control group all damn day. Yeah, you can, but people won't really be safe. Um, now what? Well, there's obviously this. Be careful, I don't fall off it accidentally. That would be tragic end to things. Uh, where the fuck am I supposed to go? Yeah, this is one of those kind of places where I just not, don't even fucking know where I'm supposed to go anymore. Oh, there we are. It gets confusing, this shit, real fast. No. Oh. Alright. That was the wrong way. I can't sprint. Yay. For this next test, we put nanoparticles in the gel. In layman's terms, that's a billion little gizmos that are going to travel into your bloodstream and pump experimental genes and RNA molecules and so forth into your tumors. Now, maybe you don't have any tumors. Well, don't worry. If you sat on a folding chair in the lobby and weren't wearing lead underpants, we took care of that too. How thoughtful of you people. Oh, yeah, crates. Yay. Yeah, yeah. 